You know, there are a lot of things that I can forgive. And I'm a very, very reasonable person when it comes to relationships. You know, I always try to hear you out. I always try to listen to you. But the fact that you took it in your interest to go out of your way to cheat on me with this person. I know, don't even think about bringing him up. You know what's funny? I'm not even mad at him. I'm mad at you. That's right. He didn't take you away from me. He didn't do those things. He already had a choice, but you also made your choice. You have the audacity to find yourself in the arms of another man instead of just simply breaking up with me. You know, I would prefer that you break my heart than doing what you did right here and right now. That is the ultimate and most disgusting thing that any human has ever done. And you have the audacity to, to what? Have me defend you in your honor for having a man sleep with you or what did you think was going to happen? I'm not going to fight for you. The moment you got into that man's bed is the moment that you were not mine. You had a choice and you made that choice. Don't you dare try to push that on me. I made my choice as much as you did yours. And to think that there were so many times where I would have been able to do the same, right? And I didn't, because I believed in us. And if I thought for a second that we were never going to work, as harsh as it may seem, I would have broken up with you, but out of respect for us. You don't deserve to be treated, but now, now that I see it, you did. But regardless, I still stick to my morals. And let me tell you, this, what we have, we're fucking done. And I, no, don't even, don't even spread the waterworks. You fucking knew what you were doing. And now you want to make yourself look like a victim? Because what? What does that do for you? If you haven't noticed, I'm the one who found out. I'm the hurt one here. And all, all the time you expect me to reinforce your feelings. The, the whole time you were always so... So conscious of my decisions. You always got so jealous. Now I see it. Because you wanted me to look bad in all of this. Now how dare you. I am fucking done with you. Every time I, I see you now, no, I'm not going to forgive you. Of course I'm not going to forgive you. You're nothing to me now. And you never will be. I had your back. You know, I can't even say... I can't even call you baby anymore. Like, I can't even say your real name. You know, it's just... I... <sighs> believed in you so much and you fucking broke my heart you should just go no don't even linger okay fine say what you gotta say and then you leave okay what do you gotta say for yourself? oh that I apparently wasn't there for you Oh, that I was a ghost, you're saying? You're right. I wasn't there enough. I wasn't, and I should have been. But is that your excuse to cheat on me? You should have ended things. I know I may have been wrong to ghost, but there is no excuse to betray the one you love. And even if I wasn't that person, did he ever stop to think of what I was going through? 
You never even called me in my time's assignments. You never even checked up on me. So as far as I know, you ghosted me with you. And it always takes two to tangle, right? So maybe this relationship fell apart at the same time it was still going on in my head. And you tricked me. And now you're trying to make me believe that what you did was right. You don't see the hypocrisy in all this? Or are you that so desperate to believe that what you went through is, is right? And, that, and that's a thing about a cheater's mentality. Is that while yes, you have your reasons, you still shouldn't have done it to begin with. The ends never justify the means. As far as I see, you really fucked up. And I can't even begin to look at you. You're dead to me. I'll still treat you like a human. I'll still treat you with respect. But you and I, this, we're done. So don't waste your breath. Because I'm through listening to you. Just another person in my life that failed me. But you know what? You're not going to change my view on people. You're not going to be a mark as to why I stopped living my life. No. This is going to be the beginning of me and I'm going to move on. So don't even think of coming for me. No. I'm through listening to you. Because you fucking hurt me. I should have never trusted your words. How did it feel? If before you say bye, how did it feel when I came crying in your arms just yesterday? And you told me how everything was going to be all right. And then I caught you today. God, you must look like the biggest fucking idiot. Right? Good job. Thanks for ruining your life. And thanks for thinking that you can hurt mine. Now we're done. Don't ever call me. I want you out of my life. And I want all of your things out of my apartment. Goodbye. And thanks for the memories.